Hello and welcome back to FTL. Well, this is actually the first time playing this game that I actually stopped mid-run. Um, it's because I, I survived, I don't know, what, what sector I'm on? Sector 4. This is possibly the longest that I've actually been in this game. I don't think I've ever made it to sector 5 before. So I'm just reacquainting myself with my ship. So it's one of these NG thingies. I've got three crew. I've got uh, Tilk on the engines. I've got uh, Kata, which should be Carter. <laughs> um, she's at the helm, and Helen, who was obviously a recruit I got along uh, got along the way, is manning the weapons. Now I've got myself an Ion Blaster two, which is really good. Um, a heavy, um, a large burst laser or a burst laser three, which fires five shots. Fortunately, I can't power it at the moment. Um. I'm trying to build up my uh, weapons thing there, obviously, but I've got to get that to... Or can I? Hang on. Oh, no. Okay, and I've got two for that. So I can power the heavy burst laser, but it takes a long time to charge up uh, equipment. It's 19 second charge time. That's a four second charge time. So, um... I think what I should do is like um start with start with the ion blaster maybe ion blast to the weapons because that will take out the shields and then the weapons and then that will give me time to switch to the large burst laser and I'm going to save up and try and get the extra the uh, the extra power bars I need so I can run both of those at the same time because that would be cool now, I am quite low on fuel. I've only got three left there. So, well, let's see. On to the next sector. Um, only one choice. Going to a civilian sector. Right, okay. Welcome to a new sector. Get to the exit beacon and jump to the next sector before pursuing the rebels. Oh, yes, this is that scrap bonus thing. Now... I think I'm going to do this. Um, reason being that this game on normal is almost impossible. And easy, um, on easy mode, I've seen people playing this on easy mode, easy mode is still pretty hard. Um, so I think they sort of misnamed the difficulty settings. And the main difference between the difficulty settings seems to be just how much scrap you get. So, um, if I don't manage it to get you know to get through this time then then my next playthrough will probably be on easy anyway so i'm going to take this little bit of extra scrap i've got um simply because otherwise i don't stand a chance uh, especially because i'm so low on fuel so i don't consider it what well, obviously i do consider it a bit cheaty otherwise i wouldn't be trying to justify it so much to myself and to you, um, but hopefully you'll forgive me on this one, and we will go with the bonus scrap for now. Right, so, um, hmm. <laughs> let me, hang on, so, I've got enough power for that, so what I need is, and, and enough power for the anti-ship as well, so I need three more power, uh, three more bars in weapons and power to go there as well. And that's going to be quite expensive. But I can get another one now. Is it best to just save it up? Three more is going to come to what? 140, 215 plus three of that. It'll be about 300 scrap. Hmm. Give myself sensors so I can see what's going on inside the enemy ships. Um, could, I could up evasion, give myself a dodge, an, an extra five percent dodge. That's going to cost a total of sixty. Might be worth it on the basis that that way I can avoid being hit as often. <laughs> And so on. So I'm going to do that. There we go. That gives me an evade of 34%, which isn't bad. I've got level 2 shields. Okay, let's get on with it. Okay, uh, Nebula, Nebula. Um, let's jump 
jump down to the nebulas because that that slows down the enemy ships. Okay, it's hard to see why, but this beacon is apparently a tourist destination. One of the ships at the small station is offering a deal. Trade. Fuel 7, drone parts minus 2. Um, I really need the drones. Well, I don't need the drones as much as I did before, because I do actually now have a burst laser that I can use offensively. So, I don't want to run out of fuel, so I'm actually going to take that deal. Okay, let's jump to... This one. Oh, asteroid field, but I've got two levels of shield, so in general I'll be okay. Oh, he's big and scary. A pirate ship was laying in wait inside this asteroid field. It immediately moves in to attack. Turn and fight. Okay. He doesn't have a teleporter, but he does have some scary looking weapons there. So, um, ion blast to the weapon. So my idea is, is that once I can ion blast his weapons, then um, they won't be firing long enough that I'll be able to charge up the 19 seconds for this burst laser. Do I launch an anti-ship ship drone? I think I do. Okay, because he's got four levels of shields over there and I need to get through them as quick as I can. Oh, auto fire's not on. <laughs> oh dear, how long was I just sat there not not shooting? There we go. So between There we go. We're shoot uh, we're shooting nice and quick now and my offensive drone is pitting away at him as well. Whoa! Incoming missiles. That's why I want to get to his weapons. This might not be the way to do it though. Come on. Okay. Um Yeah. Burst laser to that. Oh, I hate those missiles. Whoa, they missed again. I'm glad I upped my evasion. Come on, fire that burst laser and please hit. Okay, we did a bit of damage. <laughs> I can't quite see... Okay, it's orange. Um, I want that red before I switch switch to his shields. So. <laughs> I don't like those things. Okay, um, Helen. Do I bother repairing that? No, I'm I'm going to wait till after the fight's over before I actually repair that. So. Make sure Helen stays there. I'm going to assume that we've got a bit of a fire going on in there, so I'm just going to open that up. Okay, come on. Burst laser once again. Okay, that's nice. Right. So, we'll burst laser his shields now. Oh, it's still only orange, though. Okay, there's no fire. First laser's almost recharged. In comes another missile. That's my shields down. Okay, that we definitely need to deal with. Whoa. Okay, um, shield's critical, yes. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. Okay, um... I could just Ion Blast. Yeah, I'm going to Ion Blast his weapons. Um, my hoping is, is that the rapid shots, now his shields are weaker, the rapid shots will keep that weapon down. Because this thing shoots a lot more often. Oh, he's, and, and he just repairs his shields. Okay, um, tell me about the Hermes missile. Pierces shields, does three damage. 
<laughs> I've no idea what I'm doing in this fight, really. Okay. Is that missile going to hit? No. Okay. So Hermes missile hopefully will take out his weapons. Okay. Get my shields back up, please. Uh, there we go. Uh, a level of shields. Hermes missile about to fire. Oh, nice. Okay. That's probably his weaponry down. And we will not accept surrender. What we'll do is we'll switch to our burst laser on his shields. Okay, you get back on my engines. You repair my sensors at this stage. I'm feeling safe enough to do that. Oh, it's... He still has a working weapon. Hmm. Okay, we'll let one uh, one burst go, and then we're going to switch back to that missile weapon. I am watching that guy's health. Okay, obviously... N okay, Helen, take over on the engines. Tilk. Take over the repairs there. Okay, Hermes missile. I wish I could have two of these running uh, running at once. That would just be so much better. Take his weapons out again. Oh, wow. <laughs> How long has that inferno been ra uh, raging in that room? And incoming missile. Oh, that's my drone control. Helen, go repair my drones. Um, Tilk, get back on the shields. Oh, I can't. I'm just going to let that fire rage for the moment. I don't think it can do any more damage to me. All right, Hermes missile. My Hermes missile is about to fire. And it misses. Of course it does. Come on, I need my drone control back. So missiles going both ways. They both miss. What can I be doing differently? I'm not sure there is anything I can do differently here. We're both just pecking away at each other, and my hull is pretty bad. Um, I'm tempted to run away, to be honest with you. I think I am. Let's get out of here. Did not like that. Let's jump to this area here. Okay. A heavily damaged Federation ship is hiding in the nebula. Before you have time to make contact with them, they fade into, fade into the nebula. Let's attempt to follow them. You get lucky and find them floating not too deep into the nebula. Thrilled to be found by friendlies, they come on board and abandon their wrecked ship. Well, welcome to my wrecked ship. Who have I got? Bars. Okay, bars. We've got a bit of... We've got... Okay, fires spread. That's interesting. You two get in there. And put that fire out. Because I can't open the doors, because that is the door uh, door control. I'm hoping the two of them can do that pretty quick. Yeah, the fire... Fires do spread. Safety tip. Wow, my hull is damaged. Well, I said this was the furthest I've ever got, and I don't think I've made it to um, this sector before. Facing enemies with four levels of shields? Okay, let's get a uh, repair effort going on down there. With those two. <laughs> okay, teal. Back on the engines, Carter. Whoa! Okay, let's suffocate that fire there. <laughs> I didn't realise the fire was spreading like that. There we go. No, I can still hear fire. What's still on fire? Okay, it was that place, but... 
Door's closed. Okay, Teal'c, you're definitely good at engines. Kata, you're a pilot. Helen, you're general... What are you? You're general repair, but you're also pretty good at weapons. Bars, you can take over the shields. <sighs> well, all systems are running again. But, um... I have taken so much damage, it's unfunny. <laughs> okay, let's just press on. And hopefully we'll come across something that's a bit, a bit more of a pushover. That's a bit, that's a bit more of a pushover. You recognise the ship as a well-known slave trader. He hails you and offers you labourers for cheap. I will attack the slaver scum. I do not like the look of his weaponry. Um, only two levels of shield, so let's ion blast him to the weapons. Oh, okay, he's got ion blaster as well. Oh, and let's do that. <laughs> Between that and that, I'm hoping I'll start to reach his weaponry. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> We're about to die, people. Um, ship is almost charged, so let's get out of here. Let's jump to this store. Um, well, I'll jump, I'll jump to that one. No. <laughs> I am not prepared for this sector, am I? I'm not sure what I should be doing differently here. A ship engineer has set up a small shop here. Okay. Um, let's fix what we can. Which is not much. What can we sell? We've got a uh, repair arm. I don't know. Um, Maybe trying to go with, you know, the burst laser and the ion blaster, and that is not a good combo. I could sell some, something and get more money for repairs. It's three per repair. Can't believe I'm 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 thinking that I have to sell stuff, but I think I do. I'm gonna sell the ion blaster. I know some of you are, prob are probably shouting at the screen saying, No, don't sell the ion blaster. But you know, I think I have to. I couldn't run them bo uh, both anyway. And it means I get at least some hull back. Okay, so we're running on the burst laser 3. Oh, we've got, a, got those hull breaches. You two go repair the oxygen to start with. Let's open those doors up. Let you get uh, get a bit of air. And repair the hull breach. It's all doors open. All doors closed. Tilt back on the engines. Bars take over the shields. Suddenly, this is a lot tougher universe. And the Rebel Fleet are coming. Let's jump down here. I'm going to go there, there, and then if I've got scrap, I might jump back to that store. But I doubt I'm ever going to have the scrap. Okay, a mercenary hails you. Greetings, friends. We've heard um, tell of your quest and are here to offer our valuable services. Except I can't afford any of your val valuable services. Um... Do I want to fight you? You have two levels of shields. I need scrap. Is the thing. And the only way to get scrap is to fight someone, and fighting someone who only has two levels of shields is better than fighting someone who has more, so... Mercenaries are worse than rebels. The only honourable course is to engage the mercenary in battle. Right. Autofire is on. Anti-ship drone. Burst laser to his shields. I suppose the idea is just to bring those down as quick as possible. And hope he doesn't have missiles. 
Yep, that's pecking away at his shields, but it doesn't really do anything. Piddling lasers, I'm okay with that. Here come my lasers. Okay. That's a little better, isn't it? <laughs> uh, burst laser his weaponry. Oh! Wow! I, I didn't even notice that I was on fire. That was dumb, wasn't it? Too busy wa uh, watching his ship. So let's put those flames out. We're ready to jump. Okay. Close doors. Open doors. Um, who can I spare? Helen, go repair that. My burst lasers are about to fire again. Hmm. I think I just carry on attacking his uh, weapons. Because his weapons are actually pretty dangerous. Well, that isn't because he doesn't have any penetration. Right, let's switch back to his shields now. I'll try and keep those down. He's only got, what, two guys over there? And he's taken quite a bit of damage, I think. Oh, hull taking damage. Ooh, missed. Well, most of the shots missed. Shield-wise, I'm just holding my own. All right, you get back on the weapons. I think it means my weapons charge slightly faster. All right, Vade is up to 40%, which is good. Whoa, don't know what that was. Come on. Take this guy out, please. Okay, he's surrendering, but that means he's about to die anyway. So I will not accept surrender. Because his sh shields are gone. Um, let's put the fire out first. So, I want you to stay there. And finish him off, please. He's only got one hit point left. One more burst should do it. And fire! Okay, he's gone. 45 scrap, which, because of my repair arm, means I get a little bit of hull back. Although not as much as I would like. So, close doors, open doors. You go repair that. You go help. Hmm... Okay, burst laser is definitely better than what I was doing. Right, tilt back on the engines. Bears, take over the shields. You learning shields? Good, you're learning shields. I'm still not doing well though. Forty. Let's jump to this store, get a few more repairs. I'll be a little happier. A transmission from the nearby planet indicates an outpost below which offers supplies to travellers. You send down an away party to check it out. I also want some fuel. A fix all is 45. Let's do that and then blow the rest on repairs. Jump distress beacon. That put me a bit too far away from the exit though. I think I'll go here. You see a small station fitted with hundreds of repair drones. You receive an automated message. We don't know who you are and we don't care, but this is the right place for some ship repair. Hmm. That's actually cheaper than the place I just was, but I don't I don't have any scrap anymore, so Oh well. Let's jump down to this one. That's a nebula. Oh, it's an explored location. An asteroid field, of course. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Right. 
he has three levels of shield and one of those special Zioni shields, which means missiles can't penetrate. A pirate ship was lying in wait inside this asteroid field. It immediately moves into attack. Okay. I will burst laser to his shields. My hope is that if I can take his shields down, these asteroids might deal with him. Whoa. Okay, my med bay's out. Uh, Helen, go repair the med bay. I'm about to fire with the burst laser. Okay, um, 13 missiles. Yes, so let's missile him in his weapons. His O2's out, at least that'll keep his crew busy. He's got a heavy laser over there. Come on, Hermes missile. Please hit, please hit. It hits. He did not like that at all. You are considerably well more armed than I would have thought. We surrender. We will not accept surrender. Let's turn off the Hermes, turn on the burst laser, and we will just spray your shields to pieces to make sure they, they do not go back up. Your weapons are on fire and damaged. I'm charging my burst lasers. Helen, get back up to the weapons. Someone being on weapons does does help them charge quicker, doesn't it? I believe that's how this works. And you're gone, sir. 30 scrap. A little bit of fuel. A little bit of repair. Okay, let's just jump up here, because we've got time. Hmm. Maybe I should have gone up there before I started coming down. Looks like I underestimated how far the re uh, how far far away the rebel fleet are. You recognise the outline of a mantis ship against the blackness. Engage. He has a teleporter and loads of mantids, or mantis. Hmm. Right. Um. Burst laser to the shields or missile. Burst laser to the shields. And prepare to repel borders. Those guys are definitely heading heading there, aren't they? They're actually in the door control. So, let's open the doors to the vacuum of space before they can actually damage the door control. Hopefully that th he's got a missile launcher there. That's not good. Come on. Oh. He just they just ran ran through there. That's because they took out the door control. Okay. Um Bears, hundred health. Helen, which of you are good at fighting? Neither of you. What about Tilk? Neither's Tilk. <laughs> Tilk is no good at fighting. Okay, who's close okay. Helen Get in there, because I think he's going to need help. Alright, I've done some damage to the shields. Whoa, I was just about to say his ship wasn't doing that much damage to me, and then that happened. So, did I not launch an anti-ship drone? I forgot to launch an anti-ship ship, ship drone. That was dumb of me. Okay, hopefully with my repairs, I mean with my... Med bay auto healing my guys. We're still taking too much damage. Okay. Okay to get to the med bay. Bears get in there. Oh, oh, Helen. Get into the med bay. Right, we're gonna have to try and swap these guys out a bit. Okay, uh, Bars is now taking damage, but Kata is feeling better. Helen is feeling a bit better. Oh, okay, intruders are all dead. Okay, Kata to there. Teal'c, you're on the engines. Helen, get 
back on the weapons. Bars, stay where you are for the moment. Are we still shooting? <laughs> I'm so busy watching the fight, I have no idea what's going on with the actual ship battle. Okay, that's nice. I, I definitely got his weapons offline. Uh, the hull breach can wait for the moment. This thing can just rip through the shields enough that I don't have to bother aiming at his actual shields. There we go. Oh, these fights are getting intense. Okay, 50. Right, I've got to do something about this. What I need are my two best repair guys, which is Helen, Helen and Teal'c, to both repair that door control as quickly as possible, so I can close the doors. There we go, and open them. And now I need you to repair that oxygen leak before we all suffocate. I do like the uh, nanobots which flood the ship and, and heal the people. It makes doing stuff like that a lot safer. Bars, get back there. Phew. Right, I've got 50. Um, still would be nice to get the missile up, but I don't think it's likely right now. Maybe I should think about another an another level of shields. That would be 160. Yeah. I'm... Oh no. Yes. Yes. 160 for another level of shields. I'll save up. <sighs> Oxygen's coming back. Let's just let's just e equalize all the oxygen in the ship. All right. We're good enough to jump. Could jump up there and then back. Okay, I'm not actually at the exit. I'd have to go one, two, three. Wouldn't work. Let's just go to the exit. Okay, you've arrived at the long range beacon. When the FTL charge, you can jump to the next sector. Anything here? A ship refueling station um, is stationed at this beacon. We can purchase fuel here. Six fuel for 12 scrap. Yes, fuel is always a problem. So, thank you for your business. Okay, on to the next sector. Okay, well, that's it for this episode. Um, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.